Hey everybody, Unstable Gamer here, and welcome back to Looney Tunes World of Mayhem. In this video, we're gonna discuss the new Hunter team. We now have a complete Hunter team. Are they a new top tier team? I wanna take a look at them. I am having a lot of fun with them, and I wanna go over that with you. But first, before we do, if you're just now finding this channel, and you wanna stay up to date with this and other games, consider hitting that subscribe button so you don't miss out. All right, and welcome back. So let's go ahead and jump right into this. The Hunter team, we have a new fully put together um, Hunter team here. Are they a top tier team? I don't know that they're necessarily a top tier team, uh, but they are a fun team to play and they do require some strategy. They're not anything that's gonna really overpower any other team, but I have been able to do some punch up and I have been able to punch up anywhere between 30 and 70K. It's nothing like the Magic team where I can punch up over 100K, but um, again, when you do go up against different teams, it's going to depend on the teams, the, th the synergies and things like that that are that are in play. But let's just go ahead. Let's take a look at the Hunters team. Have some fun with it. I'll show you how I typically play them. And uh, very curious in your thoughts on what do you think about this Hunter team. All right, let's go ahead and jump into Brawl. All right, so let's go ahead, jump into here. Um, they're really starting them off easy. I don't have anybody over 100. So let's go ahead and jump into here. I am at 112K. Shouldn't have too many issues with this, but this will at least help show the rotation that I typically use. A few things I really like about this, like Major Canasta, this one right here, the first time each ally defeats an enemy, they're gonna get 100% turn meter. They're gonna get an additional turn. This right here at the end of this tune's turn, gain two defense up and two piercing up for each hidden tune in battle. So a lot of benefits there for hidden tunes. And then this as well, Hunter team members deal an extra 10% max health damage whenever they land an attack. If they're hidden, this damage is 100% lifesteal. So a lot of good benefits with this team. So let's go ahead. I'm going to taunt right off the bat, get those attack downs. And then I'm going to go ahead and stun Van Wiley up there. And then uh, let's go after the healers. Let's go after uh, Petunia Pig there. So just do the basic. And we'll do this. That should take her out. And he gets to go again. So now we'll work on Elmer Bugs. We got Van Wiley who is stunned. Elmer's down. Let's see. We should be able to take Van Wiley out with uh, Contraptionist. And if we can, we'll get an additional turn there. And then we'll just, uh, let's do the piercing. The damage and gain the piercing up. So that was a pretty quick and easy battle. Um, about 40k over. <laughs> that was about 40k over on that one. Uh, but let's see if we can find another battle. But that's the typical rotation that I will use. Should have somebody. Okay, so 143K right here. So not too much of a punch up, but let's see how we do against this team. 112 against a 143. All right, so let's do the taunt. I am going to stun Granny. And let's see. Uh, I'm going to work on this guy, actually. Let's go here. Granny's done for a little bit. Let's go ahead and hide everybody. And I did... Oh, well, I had him. There we go. All right. <laughs> um, we're going to go after Sam here. I didn't change my target. All right, we'll do that. So keep into the same rotation for the most part. We'll go ahead and get rid of Sam there. That was his first time taking somebody out, so we get to go again. Um, we're just gonna keep Granny um, stunned, but we can unhide, so this right here is gonna remove hidden, so we can get go after our uh, old Mike there. And it took him out, so that works. There we go with that, and boom. So pretty easy for the most part. It. When you, when you get familiar with the rotation and what each character can do, like remove, uh, using a skill to remove hidden, um, using a skill with Sam the basic to get that defense up, uh, taking out an enemy for the first time so you get an ad additional turn, you just get additional attacks. It's fun. It's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and grab this. And let's try one more. See if we get anybody higher. Let's push our luck. I'm not going to go to 244. We could try the 158. Because I have been able to push up anywhere between 30 to 70k, depending on the team that I go up against. So let's try the 158. The uh, 244 is way out of my league. So here we go. Let's see what we got. Let's see if we can put everything into play here. So we're going to do the taunt to do the attack downs. 
Then we're gonna stun. I think it's probably more beneficial. We can't stun anybody right now because we've got that taunt up. I'll go ahead, we'll go ahead and stun the tank because that's gonna come back around. We're gonna move, hit, we're gonna get rid of his taunt and let's work on Sea Devil up here. Get rid of her slows and everything. See if that works. I do, the counters are also very awesome. Sea Devil is down. That was very cool. That whole domino effect there I think is very cool. That's another thing to really call out to is with Outback Dog on there giving counter to everybody is absolutely awesome. So let's see, we've got Sam stunned right now. So let's work on the healer. Let's get rid of him. Oh! And Sam got taken out. That sucked, but we should still be okay. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead, put another trap out for Sam. There we go. So, major canasta for me is very low compared to everybody else on this team. If I had him built up just a little bit more, um, then we would have been able to three-star this, but you can see the potential of this team. Is it a top tier team? Probably not, maybe middle of the pack. But it is a fun team and it requires strategizing and they've got some fun mechanics and maybe we'll find a good spot for them. Maybe in the Alliance boss battles that we have coming up, the Alliance R&D, maybe there's some place that we find a really good place for this team. I enjoy them. I think they're a lot of fun. Very curious. What do you think of this new Hunter team? How far have you gotten them? How far have you been able to get them to punch up? Because I love seeing how much we can punch up on these teams. All right, everybody, that is what I had for you. Again, very curious in your thoughts. Let me know. As always, I want to thank you all for taking the time to watch the video. If you liked it, make sure to hit that like button and share your thoughts and questions in the comment section below. Take care, everybody, and we'll talk to you next time.